This tutorial will guide or show you how to download and install ZAMP on Windows 7 64-bit. Start your browser and go to ZAMP official website. Click download. Locate the version you want to download and click download button. Your download will start instantly. I will not wait for the download to complete because I have ZAMP already downloaded in downloads folder. When the download is complete, go to the folder where ZAMP is saved and double click on the executable file to start the installation. In my case I have ZAMP in downloads folder. If you have user account control, UAC, enabled, you will get a confirmation box, click OK to confirm. You can learn more about how to disable user account control, UAC, on Windows 7 from the video link in the description below. Click OK on Confirm box. On Welcome to ZAMP Setup Wizard window. Click Next. On Select Components window. Select the components you want to install. By default all the components are selected. You can uncheck the components you don't want to install and then click Next. On Installation Folder window. Choose folder where the application files will be stored. Click folder shaped icon on the right of the current selected installation directory destination. The click to select a folder on your computer. Then click OK to confirm your ZAMP installation location and click Next. On Bitnami for ZAMP window. Uncheck Learn more about Bitnami for ZAMP, unless you want to do so, and then click Next. On ready to install window. Click next. Wait for the installation process to complete.
on completing the ZAMP setup wizard window. Select do you want to start the control panel now. Checkbox and click finish. This will start ZAMP control panel automatically. Select a language. Check the box next to the American flag for English, or the one next to the Germany flag for German. On ZAMP control panel start MySQL and Apache server. Click admin on the same row with MySQL to open MySQL dashboard on your browser. Click admin on the same row with Apache to open localhost dashboard on your browser.